Hey guys, today I'm going to do a fall makeup look for you. So a lot of the, um, I posted a picture on Instagram and Facebook of my, it's like a purpley, purple with a golden peach is, are the colors. Um, and a lot of people requested that I do a tutorial, so, or asked how I did it. So I'm going to do that for you guys today. Um, so I've got all my makeup here. Um, no, that's not all of it actually, because I also have these. These are my brushes, my palette, and then lip gloss, because there's no room. So, <laughs> this is where all my makeup sits. Pretty excited about it. Okay, so I'm going to hang this up um, over there, and then we're just going to dive right in. So I'm going to do my foundation, bronzer, contour, highlight, blush, all of that uh, first. And then I'm going to start the tutorial. So if you want one specifically for all of those, um, let me know. But uh, we're just going to focus on the eyes today. So give me just a second and I'll hop right back on and we'll start with the eyes. Okay, so I've got my foundation on, contour, bronzer, um, and blush. So I've got all of that on. Um, which actually, let me blend some of this up a little bit. Okay, so we've got all that on. Okay, so now we're going to do our eyes. So, um, gonna make sure it didn't crease. So I've got eye primer on, but every time I put concealer on over it, or the under eye corrector, and then it tends to crease a little bit more. So once it creases and then I brush it out, it's usually fine. And then I always set it with uh, translucent powder as well. So just to really quick what I did. So I, I did our foundation primer, eye primer, um, under eye corrector, and concealer. Um, foundation, I use matte because I'm pretty oily. Um, I've got our, yeah, and then blush, contour, all of that. And this is our blush, okay, so. And then of course our translucent powder, which is this guy, to set it using the brush, okay. So that's it, and I used a beauty blender. I, I think I actually like this the best now. Um, we have our uh, foundation brush, which I really like as well. I kind of switch back and forth. I don't know, you never know. So it looks a little bit heavy right now. So I'm actually going to blend that a little bit out. Blend that, blend, whatever. We're gonna pick up some of that product. Okay, we're good. Um, I also did our brow, so I used the brow pencil and then our tint our volumizing brow tint, which is awesome. Okay, so that covers what I used. Now I'm going to do our eyeshadow, my eyeshadow. Um, so I guess I need my brushes. I'm gonna be using these three today. Um, and we're just gonna dive right in. So for starters, I'm going to use our Dusty Rose color here, which you can't really tell in the but it's it's kind of like a a muted pastel pink ish I don't know um, so we're gonna take that with our all over eye brush tap it off and then we're gonna put this right in the crease and then we're gonna blend it up um, Okay, with this, there's just lots and lots and lots and lots of blending. That is the trick to getting good eyeshadow. So you just blend, 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 um, just go crazy. So, I feel like that's pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna do one eye and then I'll just, I'll hop off, do the second eye and then I'll hop back on. Just so you don't have to watch me the whole time. Um, so we've got our Dusty Rose on. I'm now gonna come in with our um, Merlot. I don't know if you can see that, let's see. The Merlot color here, it's just dark purple. Um, so I'm gonna wipe my brush off and then take this 
There's some fuzzies on there. Okay, tap it off. And what this is going to go in the outer edge of our eye. I know I'm saying our because it's just my eye, but if you're doing this with me, <laughs> then our eyes, <laughs> whatever. Okay. And we're going to blend up into that dusty rose color. Guys, I'm super excited because for the holidays we always release new products, right? Just for fun. Just for fun. Why not, right? Um, and um, we've got some new brushes for the holidays and I'm super stoked because they look awesome. And I can't wait. I get to order them on the 10th, so if you have any questions about them, let me know. Because I can only order a certain amount, so if you want them, you're going to have to hop on them. But anyway, uh, okay, so we've got... I'm going to blend a little bit more right here. In fact, I'm actually going to take some of that Dusty Rose on my brush, tap it off, and then I'm going to put some more right here just to kind of help blend that. I think that's good. Got a little bit too much right in here. Keep dropping my towel on the ground, so that's gross. Okay. I think we got it. No. Let's see, we're gonna pull this up a little bit more. I think we got it. I think I definitely got it a little too far over here though. Okay, so now I'm gonna come in with Blossom, which is just this, it, it's, it looks white in the camera. But it's uh, it's just a really light, light pink, and I'm gonna kind of come and highlight over this this top part here. Wiping my brush off, and then I'm gonna make sure that's blended. Okie dokie. Okay, so now we've got... I'm going to grab our finishing spray. Um, I'm going to pick up the... So this light peach color, or golden peach color is what it's called. Oh my gosh. Okay. So this color right here, I'm going to use next. So I'm going to take our finishing spray and spray the tip of my brush. Um, in my lap, apparently. Um, and then we're going to... Just pick up the the eyeshadow with the finishing spray, and then just press it onto my eye. This just helps it go on a little bit better, uh, and it gives it a more like foil type look. It's a little more shimmery. Um, I just like it a little bit better. I don't always do this, but if I'm trying to go 
a little bit more extra, then I'll do it. And the trick with eyeshadow to get it to, to really pop is to just layer it and layer it and layer it. Um, so if you're trying to achieve the same look and you're like, well, it's not working, well, try layering it a little bit more. And then it'll, then it should work. I'm going to take some more of this finishing spray. Just press it on. Like so. Okay, I'm actually going to come in again with our... This brush. This is our eye crease brush. And I'm going to come in again with that darker purple. And just make sure the edge of this is really dark. I'm going to blend it just a little bit. Make sure it's all good. Okay, so now, last but not least, for the inner corner of our eye, I'm going to use our eye smudger brush. It's just a little rounded, whatever, I don't know, rounded brush. Okay, so I'm going to come in with the Moonstone color. It's similar to this uh, crystalline here, um, but it's a little bit warmer. So I'm going to pick that up and put that right on the inner part of my eye. Okay, so my nose is itching. Okay, um, we've got our eye on. I'm going to put my other one on, and then I will be right back. Okay, so I've got my other eye on. Uh, I'm going to put a little bit of eyeshadow on the under, on the bottom of my eye. Uh, so I'm going to start with the Merlot, the, the dark purple, with this uh, eye crease brush. I'm going to come in just on the bottom, and uh, just kind of... Tie it in with this top part here. So we gotta make it even. Okay. And then we're gonna grab some of our, um, you know, dusty rose color. And then I'm going to come in just on the edge here and just kind of blend. that out so it's not just this harsh purple line um let's see okay then i'm going to come in with the golden peach just a little bit I think, I think that's even, I don't know, it's hard to tell. When in doubt, blend a little more, I guess, right? Okay, I know I'm saying weird things today, whatever. Okay, so now we've got that on. So now I'm going to prime my lashes. Um, and then actually, I think I need to blend this a little bit more right here. I'm 
Let's see. Okay, I think that's good. Sure, okay. So now I'm gonna prime my lashes. Um, this lash primer is pretty awesome. Um, it just helps add some volume and length. And it's clear, so... So I don't know, it's just clear, I guess. Okay. Cool. So now we've got that on. Um, while I wait for that to dry for just a second, I'm going to put on my lip gloss. So for starters, we just got new lip glosses and they're pretty amazing. So I'm going to pull them all out. Well, I don't have all the colors yet, but this is what I have for myself. Um, yeah. Okay. Wow. Maybe. Okay. There. So that's what I have for me. Um, pretty excited. Um, I use the beach bronze, I think is what it's called for this look. Um, honestly, you could use, yeah, most of these would be awesome. So, um, last time I did it with just my, just the, the bronze over my lips. Today I'm going to try it with the lipstick and then I'll put the lip gloss over it. So I'm going to do our rosewood lipstick here, maybe if I can find it. It's a pretty natural color, and then I had lip balm on, so it doesn't didn't go on like crazy well. But I think it looks good. And we're gonna do the copper, or no, the bronze on top. Sure. And there you go. This stuff is awesome. And it's not sticky either, which is super cool. Um, okay, so now I'm going to put our... Put the, so I use the Ultimate Mascara for this look. Um, it's pretty awesome. This is the brush. Um, and probably my favorite is still probably the Lash Intensity. But the Ultimate... I mean, I use them all interchangeably. They're all pretty good, so... We do have an eyelash curler. Which I may curl, we'll see. Oh, I forgot eyeliner, but we're just gonna skip it, cause whatever. Might as well try curling them, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I don't know. Okay. Here goes. Did it do anything? Oh, 
Oh, there we are. Okay. There. Okay. Cool. Okay, got some. Okay, whatever. Um, might as well come in with another coat. Man, I'm getting it everywhere today. What the crap? Okay, let's see. Well, we're going to let it dry first. Okay, I'm into my bottom lashes. This is probably my favorite brush for my bottom lashes, honestly. The Fanorama is pretty good too, though, actually. I don't know. Okay, so that is our look for the day. Um, I got mascara everywhere, on this side anyway. I don't know what's up with that, but. I'm gonna come grab some of that and then. Let's see, we'll come in with this. And just make sure it looks even. Okay, we're good. Cool. So that is our look for the day. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. Or uh, if there's any other looks that you want me to do, um, let me know. Okay, anyway. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I don't know. I ramble and talk the entire time. I don't know how people do it. Um, but... Um, yeah, obviously if you add liner, it's going to help, um, like, it just helps kind of tie it all in together, um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, obviously, so you'll set it, for setting spray, um, it's pretty awesome, where's the front, I don't know, there it is, um, and that is it, so hopefully you enjoyed it, I said that already, but have a good one, guys, thanks.